He has taken individuals who have never left their block to other continents for personal development trips. This gentleman is a leader of leaders. It's one thing to lead. It's another thing to lead leaders. Leaders are tough. Leaders are strong-willed, strong-minded. That's how they got to be leaders. So to have the perfect combination of firmness, yet understanding, of strength, yet sensitivity, to be able to walk a walk that is scrutinized every step and come out spotless and on top every time. I affectionately call him Optimus Prime. That will make us the Autobots. <laughs> he is the lion on to our Thundercats. <laughs> he is an example. He is a. There were individuals that were in Birmingham, Alabama, and never went to see Martin Luther King. Yeah. It was individuals in D.C. that skipped the march that day. Just because history was made doesn't mean everybody knew history was being made or that they showed up. Mm. It's somebody who said, years later, Grandma, I know you was around. How was it meeting him in person? And they said, I was always working. I didn't go. I didn't make it to the march on Washington. I couldn't get a babysitter. I missed that bus. And that child had to walk away disappointed in a story they could have heard if somebody would have just known that history was being made hmm. right then at that moment. We are witnessing a mogul in the making. That's right. Yeah. Wow. Please understand. This is your opportunity to witness and participate in history. <laughs> you will either read about it or you will be in those pages. Mm -hmm. We pray. But it's going to happen with or without any of us in this room. Because that's the type of doing that he is. If this is the Justice League, <laughs> he's Superman. This gentleman is Kyle L. Superman. Not just a man, but Superman. Superman. Someone of impeccable integrity. And the thing that makes Superman so special is that all he can think about is the safety of the people around him. That's all that matters to him. And I can honestly say that that is a characteristic I really should share. I need you all to get up out of your seat. For our mentor, our big brother, our father figure, our millionaire coach, the man himself, People have just an incredible day. It's hard to put in the words. Yeah. Oh. And uh, you know, so many people um, could have been here, uh, but decided not to come. But you did. Not only did you come, but you stayed. <laughs> yeah, too many folks ask me, listen, will we take breaks? I say, no. 
and said, you mean people actually going to stay in the room? I said, you haven't been to a team business box for the event. It's, it's captivating because it's not about the speakers. It is about the information that the speakers share. And, and it makes you sometimes even daydream. It's hard to get to know because you start to apply it to where you are in your life. And to me, I don't know about you, but I don't even feel like I've been sitting there. But when you hear about right. a 10-hour train, you feel like, oh right. my gosh. Now, I must admit, I must admit uh, that things have changed in my life as I have aged a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> because when I started, I was in my 20s. In the bathroom break. And, you know, when I was in my 20s, 40 seemed old. Yeah. <laughs> no, it did. But now I'm actually offended <laughs> when people call 40 old. <laughs> you know, when I started prepaid legal, People would take a picture and they say things like, my gosh, you remind me of my son. You remind me of my brother. But the last event I went to, I was signing someone's book, feeling good about myself. You know, I signed autographs now. I was feeling myself in the hot. Until she said to me, you remind me of my father. But see, you can be 18 and enjoy being with that. Right, right. See? And I'm a son that's over 18. So she was absolutely right. I just didn't want to hear it. <laughs> So I said all I have to say, the things have changed. Right. I just sit right in the front row, and I could sit there the entire time uh -huh. and hold it. <laughs> <laughs> right. And I was fighting to get up. I was like, I gotta lead by example. And you know, some things you just can't control with age. <laughs> Whether you ready or not. I'm not used to that. I'm getting used to it. Oh, that's so, <laughs> so I know Mr. Branch, you know, and just an awesome host. Woo! Yeah. Said, you know, hey, look, you know, don't sleep, you can't sleep, but you know, again, you know, everybody has it. But look, I plan on being here, like forever. I believe prepaid legal. So even if I'm not actually building the business, I want to be as an example of what can happen for those who are coming behind me. But I can't promise you when I'm 88 that I can fight. You know what I mean? I'm gonna, I'm gonna try my best, and I just, you know, every now and then, stay safe, come on along. You know what I mean? It's like, hey. So I don't judge, because I, you know, I don't know what you have to go through on the way here. I don't know, your, I don't know your situations. You know, narcolepsy, all kind of things just take place. <laughs> Let me do this, and, and I'm going to be quick. I, I'm actually going to do something different this time around. I'm known for telling it like it is. Big events, when something's going awry, and said, Darnell, go out there and tell him. <laughs> <laughs> People fighting, go make them stop. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to do something a little different today, out of character. But before I do that, I wrote a couple of things down here so I wouldn't forget. One, uh, you know, we, we do have a great, this, by the way, this event was hosted by Team New Vision, but it's not a Team New Vision event. And I hope no one's offended by that, because the reason why we passed out Chicago forms, even though it's sponsored by Team New Vision, we always have open arms to everybody within prepaid legal services. It's like, it's like having a favorite team as a part of the NFL. You can have, just because you 
and love you know, one team does not mean that you have to hate on another team. Everybody with me? So I happen to love Team Division and I love pre-made legal. It'd be crazy for me to love the Redskins but hate the NFL or vice versa. Everybody with me? Right. So I just love the competition. I love who we are. And so we invite everybody because we realized this event was special, but it was a mind-stretching, mind-expanding event. The purpose of this event was so that when you sat down, you thought one way, but when you got up, you are now thinking another way. We know we could spend hours teaching you how to sell a membership, how to do prepaid legal, how to, to schedule a private business reception, which some folks may spend 10 hours to do that. However, I guarantee you this, and I don't guarantee a lot, if you took 10,000 people and put them in another part of the convention center and taught them the how-tos, and we taught you with 2,000 people, which are here today, the why to, and to expand your mind so you stay, along, stay around long enough until you figure out the how to, this 2,000 will conquer the 10,000. Any day, any time, anywhere, any place. <laughs> so if my folks know how to do prepaid legal, they're not in prepaid legal, so what good is to know how to sell a membership in a company you no longer participate in with? <laughs> so, just thought I'd get that out of the way. So sponsored by Team Division, but all the prepaid was always welcome. We only can hold 2,500, maybe 3,000 people, not even that, 2,500 people in Chicago. It's already halfway full. <coughs> so we thought we'd at least invite everybody. If you have another team event that you go to, man, God bless you all. We look forward to competing with you at the next event. So, but, uh, <laughs> but everybody's welcome, so we pass it out for that. If you're Team Division, we expect that you're going to be there because we expect that you're coming to get the knowledge which is laid out differently than this event. It's, it's not about expanding your mind there. It is about learning through skit format. Okay, intertraining is what we call it. And I've never seen another training like that in my life in this industry. I just happen you know, to be a part of the organization. So I sound biased, but I'm speaking truth. So, you're invited. <laughs> also, uh, the young lady, Ms. Williams, who um, drove from Oklahoma to Kentucky and then got on the bus. Uh, had one of the vineyards come up to me, this is what they do, and said that he wanted to sow a seed and pay for Ms. Williams to go to Chicago because he believes in her commitment in herself. <laughs> 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 